What happened to Irving? Ah. Will, he can't have gone too far. Josh. Thanks. Take me later. We go Cooper. I'm on it. Got you coming. All right, let's take these guys out. You'd think they would, I don't know, give these, give their, I don't know. If these guys are supposed to hold off Chris and Sheva, you think they'd give them something other than crossbows? I mean, I know on a gameplay and mechanic wise, that would just be kind of take all the fun out of everything, because, you know, you'd be bombarded every three seconds by the onslaught of the dam, but. Yeah, let me eat a raw egg. That'll heal my, uh, you know, third degree burns and bullet wounds. I also love the fact you can just shoot crossbows out of the air, like, it's just nothing. Like, crossbows, please. See what you two can do to get it over. What we can do? Let me tell you what we can do. We can run around and get killed. Nah, we're not gonna get killed. We've got an- we've got the ar- we're carrying just a ridiculous arsenal of weaponry. So, that's not gonna happen. Not, not really. I don't know why I picked it up. Here, a gift from me to you. To show that I care. Somewhat. So we gotta do, we do a couple of these and then we fight Irving. Thank you, Sheva. There, there's a point in the Sheva box. It's a very small box. I keep it in the corner. Move it, Sheva! It is odd to me that they had Resident Evil 6 and didn't include Sheva. They, they are so... All right. Capcom's very bad at making characters recurring when they don't need to be. Albert Wesker probably didn't be in quite as many Resident Evils as he is currently in. Get down. Uh, same with Chris, especially for Leon, who is a rookie, I believe at the time, rookie police officer in, you know, of the Raccoon City PD. So, you know, he wasn't even a star, he was rookie Raccoon City, now he's... Guarding the president, he's doing special missions, all because he survived, which granted, impressive feat, no doubt. Very impressive feat that he could survive the, you know, Raccoon City outbreak. Especially with William Birkin running around, but, I don't know, it's always been kind of odd to me that, that they allow these people to keep coming back into the life. Okay, maybe, I guess maybe Chris, I don't know. I, I just, I don't know. It's always okay. odd to me. You two know what to do. So, uh, and it's especially all that shell he's she's not even in the they had two movies I think they both came out after Resident Evil 5 I want to say I think maybe uh, Degeneration I think that's what the, uh, the first one was called the CGI one not the ones with Mila Jolovich um, I believe it came out either before or around the time of Resident Evil 5 so maybe understandable that that one didn't have Sheva but I'm surprised they didn't shove her in the damnation which had uh, our dear friend uh, ow crap Kill me. Kill me. Are you okay? Thank you. Well, that's convenient, isn't it? Damn, Sheva. Nice shot. Nice shot indeed. Let me go get her to wait. I'll take the machine gun ammo. Don't really need it. 
I mean, I've got a Gatling gun on my back, so it's not like we're, you know, an infinite mag or you know, magnum whatever. So we're not really running out of uh, materials, as it were. Is there any jewels in here? I don't even know why I'm bothered collecting money. I've got, like, everything in this game, pretty much. Maybe not every infinite weapon, but we got a good chunk of everything. I've got all the jewels before and all that fun stuff, so, yeah. Can we pick that up? Yeah, we're gonna drop that. Pull the lever. Why would they even build a contraption that required two people on opposite sides to open like this? That seems very impractical for the purposes they're currently using this facility for. It just seems kind of like a, uh, I don't know, pointless little detour. You know, Chris, for once it's not your giant muscles that's blocking the camera. It's the Gatling gun. Sorry, your dynamite didn't work. Here's a parting gift. Okay. Now let's go get this Irving. Woo! Irving! Woo! E. Let's go murder us in Irving. Should be fun.
You know the absolute ridiculous just amount this virus mute or not virus parasite mutates is just absolutely ridiculous. I mean, holy crap. I mean, screw you know, screw having the little villagers infected. Just give them one of these master parasites, and they'll just wreck. I mean, it has incredible regenerative regenerative abilities. And it just completely mutates the host in just such a horrific way that, you know, they're never going to have a normal life after this. I mean, come on. Look at this. This is ridiculous. Look at this. We're fighting a sea monster. I guess the one downside would be that. Ow. Oops. Oi, Ving! Come on, throw the tentacles up. I want you to. Poor Irving. Can you imagine if that thing was just let loose? I mean, holy crap. Talk about damage it could do. What the? Sheva might kill Irving before I do. At the rate it's going. I was trying to Gatling gun it, but that didn't really work. Oh! And we got him. Tell me what you're planning to do. Damn, Excella! I guess I wasn't with the good stuff. Ah. Excella? Where is this facility? Answer me. What is the Ouroboros project? You say yay. Wow, you two are just on top of everything, aren't you? The balance of the oil is changing and you're completely oblivious to it. What's changing? What are you talking about? Is it the Ouroboros project? Is that it? No one can stop it. Uh, Ouroboros is about to change everything we've ever come to know. Chris! Uh, uh, Chris? See your Chris. <laughs> What's so funny? How do you know about me? All your answers are way to head, Chris. In that cave. If you can survive long enough to get them. Italian's not so bad, but it's not gonna change anything. You're still screwed! We're wasting time here. Chris! <laughs> Poor bastard. Now what? We keep going. So, that takes care of chapter 3-3, almost the majority of it was cutscenes, and uh, yeah, I'm trying to go by uploading these by chapters, just because it makes it a little bit easier, and they are divided a lot better that way, so uh, we'll go on to the next one now, and uh, I honestly can't remember what the next one is, but hopefully it's pretty decent, so yeah.